Halt! I recognize you from the village, Wonder Poster. You're under arrest for the pilfering of hats. Oh. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, Mr. Hat does have a bit of a hat obsession, so it makes sense that he would be a, a, on a wanted poster for stealing hats. Hey guys, at Mars here. Welcome back to Shovel Knight Showdown. So today we're going to be playing as Mr. Hat, who is a bit of a mixed attacker. So the way Mr. Hat works is that he can switch freely between his hats. He has a he has a ranged attack for one hat, a melee attack for another, and if he guards guard successfully, he uses King Knight's um, sword hat thing that he has in um in um King cards. So in any case, easy difficulty. But yeah, this is gonna be interesting. All is not well at the Tower of Fate. A terrible truth had been revealed. Spectre Knights stormed off, filled with rage at the Enchantress. Their final battle was imminent. The residents of the tower gathered. They boldly decided to rebel and help their friend. Hastily, they had a plan to modify the magic mirror. Perhaps they could trap the Enchantress inside. With the preparations complete, the ramshackle contraption sprang to life. But something went terribly wrong! Yeah, again, Mr. Hat doesn't get to be in the thing. Unfortunately. Because he's not a main character. He's a side character doing his own thing. He doesn't get to be in the mirror. Mr. Hat planned his acquisition of a new stock with a gleam in his eye. It was a fine day indeed, and nothing too out of the ordinary. The world around him was brimming with hats, just waiting to be discovered. Moreover, were those two potential customers in the distance? Okay, so he's just trying to collect hats for his hat shop. Oh, we unlocked gold armor through this guy! Oh, that's gonna be fun! So, gold armor is basically the standard, um, is basically your standard, um, character for the game. He's basically your standard mook. That's all he is. See, that's what his role is. So apparently we're going to be unlocking him this time. That's going to be fun. Alright. But yeah, Mr. Hat throws T. He can float. He switches to his sword. Yeah, there's an achievement for actually getting all of his... Um, there's, there's an achievement you can get for actually getting a KO with each of his hats. Which is kind of cool. Okay. Now I just need to get him to... I just need you to hit me. Okay, if I can get him to hit me. I'm, I'm trying to do one of the achievements this time around. I'm, I'm losing the fight, but I am trying to get a thing. Come here. Hit me! 
And I lost. Because I was screwing around, but that makes sense. Yeah, but you're, yeah, but the achievement is that you're supposed to get in all of them. Yeah, I was screwing around, so that makes sense why I lost. Uh, but the thing is that you're supposed to actually um, try and get a KO with each of his hacks. He has three. His guard. His guard and then his two normal ones that he switches between. Alright. Hit him. Ah. Yeah! Yeah, Mr. Hat might be my new favorite. Mr. Hat is just my favorite character in Shovel Knight, but, um... But he's just like, he's just a fun character to play as, too. Uh, if they made a spin-off with just Mr. Hat, that would be great. They probably won't. They probably, let's be honest, they probably won't. I mean, kind of, kind of like, because Mr. Hat doesn't seem like he would be the kind of character whose spin-off would be interesting. I mean, he owns a, he owns a hat shop. There's not much you can do with that. I don't know, maybe you could sell hats to all the various patrons, but I really have no idea. But I guess we won. Also, I just realized all the Order of No Quarter, not the Order of No Quarter, but the Wandering Travelers have their own victory theme. I noticed that with the Baz. I noticed that, I noticed that when playing as the Baz last time, so, yeah, I noticed that they have their own theme. But in any case, Trouble Crown, Royal Pond, Team Showdown. Alright, I don't have a teammate, so unfortunately I'm just gonna have to, uh, Fight two on one with my bare hands. Well, she's dead already. Well done, Enchantress. You know, for the big bad of the game, you really aren't all that smart. Well, the Enchantress is dead. I can already tell. I didn't even- I wasn't even involved in any of this. This just happened. They, they're, they're killing each other. I'm not involved in any of this. Also, I do like the, um, Tropical King's boss theme. It's one of my favorite things from King of Cards. But in any case, we beat him. Oh! I'm assuming he has his own idle animations for each of his hats. That would, that would be kind of funny if it does, if it's the case. Halt! I recognize you from the village, Wander Coaster. You're under arrest for the pilfering of hats. Oh. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, Mr. Hat does have a bit of a hat obsession, so it makes sense that he would be a, a, on a wanted poster for stealing hats. Oh ho, a fan of my work, are you? Sorry, but sometimes I can't resist the call of a cranial covering. In fact, the hat you're wearing is nice indeed. The, plu the plume bobs in the air quite maddeningly, I dare say. Stand where you are! Hey, I said don't move! I need reinforcements! Oh, come give me a closer look, Mr. Gilder Guardsman. You wouldn't deny me a glimpse of such a he heady gear, would you? Oh. Oh, we gotta fight three of them. Well, that makes sense. Oh, they're the green. Oh! I think we unlocked the armor outpost as well. Ow. Ah! Unlo unlock! Use each of the items once. I'm assuming- I think this is the armor outpost unlock. I would assume. I think this is the fight, the fight theme from um when you've come to this place as the as on Plague Knight. I think that's what this is.
I died. I died again. I need to stop doing that. Well, this is going well. I'm losing. I am some. I'm losing because I'm falling into pits. I'm not supposed to be falling into pits. All right. I just need you, and then I will win. Okay. There we go. I won. And I beat the gold armor. Goodbye, gold armor. See you See you on the next unlock. Alright. Flying machine, skydack, propeller, rally. Propellers are set to high. Don't get pushed around. I... Hmm. going terribly. It doesn't seem like I'm gonna be losing. Okay. Ah. I lost it. I lost a gem. Okay. I think it's whoever's in the lead loses to. I think. I'm working that out. I won. Okay. I'm not on the screen to accept my victory, but I won. Alright. Okay, target time. This is gonna be interesting. Uh. Alright, hat man. I think your sword form would be better for this. Oh, yeah. easy. Okay. Alright, king night time! Alright, village, house of justice. Fairy frenzy. Oh, everyone is a fairy. Fl fl flutter to victory. I hate this <laughs> preset. I really do. It's not my favorite. I found, I found this preset randomly while playing one of these. And I did not care for it.
Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm not gonna win this. I'm concent- sorry I'm not commentating, I'm concentrating because this is not my personal favorite. I just want to be able to win this. Alright, King the King Game Knight won. Not surprised. I hate that one. I really do. That is not my personal favorite of the bunch. Fortunately I only have to do it once and then never again. So let's just try and I'm not entirely sure what I'm what I'm supposed to do for these. I've never I'm never really sure. Cause it's just a different control scheme. It's very weird. It's very weird, very floaty, I don't like. chance of actually winning this. Yeah, I do not like this. Okay. Oh, I gotta do another this again. I hate this. This is going to eat up all my lives. I know it is. Oh, it's going to eat up all of the all of my continues. Help me at all. Actually concentrating this time around, so shouldn't have too many problems. Oh, 
Okay, I'm losing again! Give me your gems. win. I won! Okay! I pulled it out of my ass at the last minute. Alright, there we go. Oh, that was annoying. Gear Factory, Treasure Clash, okay. That was an annoying pre preset. I did not care for that one. Alright. Hmm. Okay, get him. Okay, I think she repelled the bomb into herself. Ow. Play on the warp floor. That's, a, that's actually an achievement I think I need to unlock as well. There's a couple of these that I've been trying to get today. myself. Ah, I'm two of myself. Mirror Clone Mayhem. I already fight against your evil mirror images. I already know what this one is. Alright. One of you drop your gems, please. Or both of you, alternatively. Am I going to have to do a sudden death with myself? Uh, maybe not if- uh, oh. <laughs> oh, Mr. Hat's campaign is not going well for me. Oh, I am down to five. That is the lowest I've been down into in a while. Uh, okay. Mr. Hat's uh, thing is not going well.
Get out! down to that is bad you're not allowed to get any more so It's annoying having to fight yourself, isn't it? Alright, fine. Alright, I might actually lose this. Now that I'm thinking, I may actually lose this. happening to me. Oh no. No, 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 no. Give me those. Neck and neck! Avoid myself. No, no. Oh, no. Uh, why is Mr. Hat's end end being so hard? It's annoying having to fight your to fight Mr. Hat. It, it really is. It's fun to play as him. Not so fun to fight against him. go oh thank god I did it <laughs> okay boss time I have three extra lives and I have to fight gold armor this is your final warning thief surrender now and you'll remain unharmed ha gold armor there you are I was thinking I fought scatifos yet Daria hat is within my grasp 
I'll come unglued soon if I haven't felt. Felt. Oh, hee! <laughs> oh, don't touch my helmet. Keep your hands off of me. I'll bring you to justice. Alright, bye, gold armor. Time to die. Come here. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna die. Come here! Thank you. This guy's actually pretty nimble. And now we gotta clear the boss. I suppose it doesn't really matter who I, which hat I choose for. Since they're basically gonna be, uh... Since it's basically the same challenge. I don't think it's gonna matter. Gotcha! Oh no, maybe I should switch to my hat. My other hat, there we go. Uh oh. Thank you! Ah. Oh. Uh oh. Chicken, get the chicken. All right, never mind. Chicken doesn't want to play. Okay, the Baz, get to the get to the file gem. There we go. All right, time for the boss. I'm gonna switch to this because I think it's gonna be better for actually fighting the boss and hitting its weak point. Oh yeah, that's much better. Although, I'm still dying, but eh well. Alright. Cups away! I died. All right. Okay. Get off of me. Ah. <laughs> well, we both went down, so... Cup. Taste some. There we go. I don't. I don't know what joke I was trying to make there. Have some Joe, I guess. I don't know. And there we go. We beat the boss. All right, and we unlocked an, and we unlocked some new a new thing by playing as Mr. Hat. We unlocked a new character. Alright, unlock! First story mode with Mr. Hat! Great! Uh, there's a couple more characters I can unlock now. Alright, but in any case, that, that was Mr. Hat's story. 
He's just really, really obsessed with hats. <laughs> That's a long and short of what happened there. Uh, I can't really explain it any better than that. He just really likes hats. That's his thing. I mean... Yeah, what else can I say? He likes hats, and he's trying to steal everybody's hat. Okay. Oh, I can actually... I didn't know I could do this. I can actually skip through the credits if I want to. I'm not going to. Um, but in any case, yeah. I... That was fun. I enjoyed that. That was very, very fun. So Mr. Hat is a little bit difficult to control, but he's still a lot of fun to play as. He, has a, he can either be a ranged attacker or a melee attacker. And, and he's also got a third hat that he uses as his guard. So yeah, he's, he's pretty versatile. And I like it. I like how he plays. He's a little, he's a little different because normally every, everybody else is like situated into one playstyle. Not so much with Mr. Hat. He's able to switch between his hats and change his playstyle on the fly. And I really like how that works into, works into his story. It works well. So yeah, he's just very versatile. I like him. In my case, yeah. I unlocked Gold Armor. I don't know what the ending of this story is. All I know is that Gold Armor apparently said that Mr. Hat is on a couple of wanted posters because he's stolen a couple of other people's hats. Makes sense? Makes sense, but that begs the question of whose hats did he steal? He, he's stolen at least two. He has two different hats, which is why he is... Obs he has an obsession with hats because they give him abilities. That's why he likes hats. That's his main thing. But in any case, yeah. And all Kickstarter backers, you made this happen. Yes, I did. Well, not me, specifically. But other people who actually kickstarted the game. Okay, but in any case... Yeah, we beat it. Alright. Alright, let's see what my battle log was. Um, stage. Black Knight. Total, th total Deaths 3. Spectre Knight, total deaths 2, Gold Armor 4, Tinker Knight 5, I'm not surprised, Target 0, King Knight 8, Shield Knight 2, Mr. Hat 10 times, I'm not surprised, Gold Armor twice, Mirror of Fate 4, Total Lives Lost, 40, Total KO Count, Total KO Count, 37, Total Time Played, 25 minutes, yeah, that one took a bit longer than, than normal because I died a whole bunch. Alright, but in any case, yeah. But yeah, Mr. Hat, you can eventually get good with. Thank you for playing. Produced by Yacht Club Games. Alright. Alright guys, let's see how this story is going to wrap up. All was quiet, and the fancy shop was well stocked. But could Mr. Hat's collection ever be truly complete? Oh. He won and got his helmet. Gold Armor may have gotten away, but the Haberdasher had won his prize. With glee, he donned his new helmet. Ah! Perry! Repulsed! Mr. Mr. Hat was enthralled. Each hat told a different story, contained different, a different power. He simply had to find more. Alright, so he just has a room in his back. That he, each of which gives him a different abil power and ability. Ready? Reporting for duty! You unlock Gold Armor! Alright. Alright, new stage unlocked! Village Armor Outpost. Okay. Tip, play wacky variations of the stage by setting the game type and the chest's choice in the game options. Okay. Well. Well, let's see what we did for- what we unlocked for our thing. Um, we've unlocked Mr. Hat. No, well, we've unlocked Gold Armor. As a now added playable character. So that brings our roster up to... 17? That, play that brings our playable roster up to 17. Alright. Um, and so he's unlocked in the story now. Yeah. 17. And there's three more characters left. I'm not entirely sure what they, what they, what I do to unlock them, but they will appear in the story eventually. Um, but yeah, and then there's also the stage in here. I'm going to play as my new character. Actually, no, I'm not. I, I, maybe. I don't know. I'm trying to figure things out, but in any case, um... I'm trying to set up the thing, thank you. Uh, okay. Uh, CPU. Okay, just, just standard Shovel Knight. I don't need it to be anything complex. Yeah, new stage. 
New stage. Yeah. There's a lot of stages in this game, by the way. I don't think I'm going to unlock them all by the time I'm done playing through all the character campaigns. Because there are a lot of them. But supposedly there's one that you... One final one you unlock for playing a state a game on every single stage. So, that's going to be interesting to see if and when I unlock that. But it's going to take a while for me to actually do. But I do like that. I did like that story. So basically, Mr. Hat's entire thing is that he just loves hats because they give him new abilities. So every time he stakes a hat, he gains an ability. It's really funny. But in any case, yeah. I think I am going to leave this episode here. Next time we'll be playing as... Who are we playing as next, actually? Um... Okay, so next time we're going to be playing as Phantom Striker and unlocking whoever he unlocks. So, we'll see you that next time. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to follow me on Facebook and on Twitter in the description below. And also, check out my Patreon in the description below as well. It's only a couple bucks a month. It really helps me out, and you guys get access to a bunch of cool perks that I'm always saying thanks. So be sure to check those out in the description below as well. But in any case, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!